could I have so misjudged them? For Shang Tsung to indulge in such depravity. For General Shao to condone it. They are not the men I thought them. Despite my best efforts, neither man nor Quan Chi are who they were meant to be. They're not your responsibility. They're outworlders. But it is I who crafted their destinies, along with those of all other beings, at the dawn of history. You created the realms. I is your mind addled, demigod? I am a mere demigod now. But eons ago, I was more powerful than all of the Elder Gods combined. I was a titan, and the keeper of time. This is Gyrus. Your Majesty. Your Highnesses. Gyrus is the guardian of the Hourglass. A celestial object which lies beyond the realms. The Hourglass regulates time and destiny. When I wielded its power, it was upon me to craft all of existence. Which I did when I restarted history. Restarted? This timeline was preceded by billions more. Though this is the first of Liu Kang's design, the others were designed by his predecessor. Kronika was obsessed with equalizing good and evil. When a timeline veered too far to one or the other, she would halt it and restart history, tinkering with lives and events in the hope of achieving her golden balance. Prior timelines, Kronika gave Shang Tsung and Quan Chi mastery of the most vile magics. Shao was not a general, a tyrannical ruler bent on conquest. You, Sindel, were his ruthless wife, who would do anything to preserve your privilege. When I took the hourglass from Kronika, I vowed to do better. So in this timeline, the sorcerers would not gain their dark powers. Shao would be your loyal follower, and you would rule Outworld firmly, but fairly. But someone has interfered with Liu Kang's design. Shao, Shang Tsung, Guan Chi, all have been groomed by an unknown entity to be the villains they were in previous timelines. Where to begin? Am I to kneel to my creator? Do you expect worship? No, your majesty. My prior role was thrust upon me by circumstance. I am in no way divine. You had power over all of creation, yet you gave it up. Because I saw how it drove Kronika mad, I knew I would fare no better had I kept it. dare you conspire against Outworld? Not against Outworld, but against your misguided rule. Your deference to him leaves us all vassals. So you sanction these unspeakable horrors? Lie to me about the threats we face? Thanks to you, Earthrealm blood is already on my hands. Bloodshed, without cause or provocation! Don't move! Empress, everyone, stay back. What is it? The Amulet of Shinnok, a weapon of terrifying power. It should not exist. Its maker is powerless, as Liu Kang designed. Yet more proof of foreign interference. Enough, Prattle! You both bend a knee to Outworld's new Emperor. Put down the Amulet. Its evil is beyond your control. <laughs> do you think I do battle not train with my weapon? I am more than prepared. So General Shao casts his lot with Outworld's enemies against me. He's a fool to ally with you blood-sucking fiends. Fight. 
than Shang Tsung's monstrosities. Tanya and your daughters, they are not dead, but trapped in the amulet. We can still save them. that you are party to Shao's treason. Know that it will cost you your life. I owe him mine many times over. Sacrificing it in his service would be an honor. Fight. <laughs> Your rebellion is doomed. Your betrayal hurts most, Rain. I thought of you as a son. 
I've outgrown you, Empress. Shang Tsung's taught me that I've scratched just the surface of my power. To explore it, I can't be bound by your limits. Fight! <laughs> Forever dead to me. Your reign is over, Sindel. I remember the weak, sickly boy you were. How your father fought to push you past your infirmities. Now you repay him by spitting on his ideals? Your revolt shreds every value he held dear. Fight. name will be forever tarnished for our world. relieved, General. The amulet, Your Majesty. I hate to disrupt, but we must act quickly to save Earthrealm. Is that the command of my creator? No, your majesty. It is the request of a friend. We are 
are ready. And the Soul Stealers. Keep them running. I am sure we'll find a use for the collected souls. No. Those are the General's most loyal lieutenants. They must be neutralized if we are to shut down the Soul Stealers. Yes, they do. We should split up. No, we fight together. Stay down. This time, I protect you. We are Ermac. It is pointless to resist us. Come any closer, and you'll feel the points of my blade. We are many. You are one. Your souls will become part of our collection. Fight! Amazing, Melina. In another life, you could have been Umgadi. <laughs> I prefer this one, dearest Tanya. Yeah. We must leave. Quickly! Melina, wait! was created from the living forest souls. Mine was one of them. 
Your attack broke the spell that binds us. Now, I am in control. Father! You are Umgadi, but not Li Mei. I replaced her after your death, Your Majesty. She left the Order rather than accept punishment. Punishment? It was not her fault. A discussion for another time, Father. We must go. Greetings, Jared. Liu Kang, my friend. We meet again. It is good to have you back. We once again find ourselves in challenging circumstances. And once again, we will prevail. As always, Sindel, I am yours to command. They're unaware that the Soul Stealers are shut down. We are deep within the mountain. From here, they couldn't tell. Look at them conspiring. It is history we should not be repeating. We must take the crown. Without it, he can't raise more warriors. Our odds will improve if we can surround them. I'll distract them while the rest of you get into position. Leave it to me, Mother. Princess Molina. I bring news from Outworld. Sindel is deposed. General Shao now rules. And yet you are still free. To succeed, the General needed help on the inside. I provided it. The heir to the throne gives it up willingly. <laughs> it is a burden I've never wanted. The realm is better left in General... Uh, Emperor Shao's hands. A most mature perspective. Outworld benefits from your wisdom. Yes, Shang Tsung, it does. But not in the manner that you expect. <laughs> Gambit Princess. It is an impressive display of guile. Who knew she was so capable? You count yourselves among my doubters. I will count you among the dead. Fight!
there will be consequences for forsaking Outworld. <clears throat> Thanks to the Princess, this fight is ended. The fight, perhaps. Not the battle. True. Until your benefactor is caught, the realms remain threatened. Who is she, sorcerer? <laughs> Speak of the devil. Liu Kang. Meet Damashi. Damashi? You are the victim of deception, sorcerer. You're not Damashi. You're me. More correctly, you are me. A poor facsimile, anyway. Made lesser by Liu Kang's meddling. What's happening here? Who is he? This Chang Song is whom I battled for the Hourglass. I thought him dead. As I did you, Liu Kang. It turns out our battle released mammoth energies which ripped apart time's fabric. The fight had two conclusions. In one, I was the victor. In the other, it was you. It was eons before I discovered this. Once I did, I knew the path forward. I took this form and infiltrated your timeline. I elevated these wretches, giving them great power. Together, they sowed discord among the realms and assembled for me the Dragon Army. I led them to believe they were aiding my conquest of Earthrealm and Outworld. But my intent is to exterminate all life in this timeline, and then merge it into my own. You promised us realms. Now you leave us to slaughter? You were pawns, not partners. Your purpose served. You will be sacrificed. We served you loyally, built you the Dragon Crown. This? This is a toy. I do not need it to control the Dragon Army. Only the souls contained within. <laughs> Goodbye, Liu Kang. Neither you nor your timeline will be missed. It appears our interests align, for now. Know that I trust neither of you. I will finish you both at the first hint of treachery. <laughs> Melina, what's wrong? Wearing off must stay in control. You attack my family, I will make you suffer. Further resistance serves no purpose. This timeline will be destroyed. Fight. <laughs>
new Shang Tsung should have sent more minions. <laughs> Come forward if you dare. I will finish what Raiden could not. <laughs> Your tenacity is to be admired. Until our last breaths are taken, as long as blood flows through our veins, we are not beaten. <laughs> Noble sentiments, which in the end matter little. None of you will leave here alive. child lose her mother. If my mother dies, she won't be the only send out to perish! Fight! It's my time, dear. At least we had a few hours more. I will cherish them. Mother. You are now Empress. Rule well. I will, Mother. Father and Katana will help me. Of course. Father, what did you do? I collected your mother's soul. It resides within me. She is safe.
Hurry, everyone. We must withdraw. To move an army that large among realms, he'll need a portal, yes? More than one. You will need a nexus of portal gateways. It must be nearby. We follow them. They will lead us to it. Agreed. But we cannot strike until Raiden and Kung Lao arrive. That the Lin Kuei won't aid us is unforgivable. Bi Han has corrupted them totally. When this crisis ends, we will deal with that one. This is but the opening battle in a longer war. Titan Shang Tsung has prepared his entire timeline for it. We cannot match its strength. My counterpart said that your battle with him ripped time's fabric, creating two timelines. But how do we know that it wasn't torn further? If there are two timelines, can't there be more? Why the thought experiment, Sorcerer? You said we lack strength. We might find it in other timelines. How would we do that? We gather allies from across timelines. Other Titans to build an overwhelming force. If they exist. We have no proof that they do. We must fight the battle in front of us. We can't stake our survival on pure conjecture. If Liu Kang is right, the battle in front of us is already lost. This may be our only hope. Giris, your thoughts? It is possible. But as I am only the Hourglass's steward, such a search is beyond me. It can only be undertaken by the Keeper of Time. And I no longer wield that power. You may be able to regain it. What? How do you mean? When you gave up control of the Hourglass, I worried that one day you would find you needed it. So rather than let your power dissipate, I collected it. To this day, it remains safely stored. Why did you never tell me this? Because the process of restoring your power is likely irreversible. Returning to the life you have now as Earthrealm's protector a life you cherish may be impossible. And you did not want me tempted to make that sacrifice unless it was absolutely necessary. Correct. Thank you, Giris. You have saved us with your wisdom. Now, where have you stored my power? We must retrieve it. It is at the Fire Temple, stored in the Jade Jaguar gifted to you by the great Kung Lao. Yes, Giris. Liu Kang has proven more resilient than anticipated. He and his comrades have escaped the fortress. Forget the others. Find Liu Kang. He alone threatens my plans. You could have picked no better vessel to store my power, Giris. I have always treasured the great Kung Lao's gift. It reminds me of his meticulous nature and his generous heart. Once we retrieve the Jade Jaguar, we will proceed to the Hourglass. There, we will transfer the temporal power stored within it to you. It now occurs to me that all along, you have had unfettered access to the power stored within. You could have taken it, become Keeper of Time, but chose not to. Why? Because I have faith in your vision for this new era. I am content to be its guardian. Thank you, Gareth. Now, this process you propose, you are sure it will restore my power? As sure as I can be of one that has been neither tried nor tested. 
But even if successful, it is not guaranteed that you will find any other timelines or allies. They may not exist. <sighs> I pray this is not a fool's errand. I hate leaving the others behind. Your champions will bolster their strength against the Dragon Army. It is sure to be the mother of all battles. May the Elder Gods protect them. My ex was so wrong. The 30k I spent on this seems like a steal right now. This magic is incredible. Not magic, your loveliness. Technology. Either way, it's clear what must happen next. The gateways and the dragon army have to be destroyed. Scorpion, have you a plan? We must divide our forces. You, Shang Tsung, Quan Chi, will use your magic to attack the portals. As you do, Kenshi and Jared will grind down the Dragon Army. The rest of us will attack our Dark Doubles. If they're defeated, it will hopefully throw the Dragon Warriors into disarray. An astute strategy. Truly, I could not have devised a better one. Enough with the empty flattery. If you want our trust, give us actions, not words. It will be the end of all things. Armageddon. Unfortunate. The battle continues, Shang Tsung. Quan Chi, with me. I, for one, am not pleased we were double-crossed. It is an ire I share. May I suggest we harness our anger and use it to obliterate my doppelganger's minions. Fight. Cannot thwart. 
This pair will trouble us no more. There are more who acquire our attention. You're welcome, sorcerers. Is it me, or is that Raiden becoming insufferable? You are not wrong, but it is tomorrow's problem. Let us first solve today's. Problem solved. Two of five. It's progress. Now on to the next. Did you see 
His life force is feeding the portal's energy. We kill him. We close them permanently. These meddling minions grow tiresome. Let us finish them. Fight. So much for fire and ice. Soul is ours. Army's trapped. All of the other realms in this timeline are safe. Never forget, Raiden, that we risked our lives to perform this service. One that wouldn't have been needed if you hadn't conspired with the other Shang Tsung. They will fight to the last man. Come. 
We must help the others. other timelines and titans to find. Garrus? Liu Kang? Easy, Katana. You are among friends. What's happened? Where am I? A long way from home. In a different timeline, to be precise. What? Are you also a... A keeper of time? Yes. Both of us? How is that possible? The battle for Kronika's Hourglass ripped apart time's fabric. Where there once was one timeline, there are now many. Each new timeline represents a different possible outcome of that battle. In mine, I became Time's Keeper. In yours, it was you. In others, it could be Jade, Sindel, even Kano. The possibilities are endless. If many timelines sprung from one, and we were both part of it, then you are... You are my... Liu Kang. The same one who battled you in Shang Tsung's courtyard. Who fought at your side at the Colosseum. Who beamed with pride when you became Outworld's Khan. Why does fate seem always to conspire against us? deny us life's simple pleasures. I don't know. Perhaps in one of the many timelines, they are ours. I would like to think you brought me here for them. But I know you well enough to know better. What duty beckons us? I will tell you. But first, we must gather more of our old friends. Shang Tsung, a titan, wielding the power of the Hourglass? Yes, Kung Lao. He is a threat to all timelines. He is not yet aware of any beyond his and Liu Kang's. For now, it is only a matter of time. I had hoped my victory over Kronika would end the endless cycle of combat. Sadly, it begins anew. We have no choice. We must stop Shang Tsung. The millions in my White Lotus Society will aid us, if needed. Thank you, my friends. He is here. have found allies. Titan allies, in fact. How could I have been so blind? Of course our timelines aren't the only two. Retreat to yours, Shang Tsung. Your attempt to merge timelines has failed. Yes. Your comrades proved most resourceful. Thus, I have resigned myself to simply destroying your timeline. Knowing that others exist to conquer makes that choice much more palatable. Once I destroy your hourglass, your timeline will cease to exist. I will take great pleasure in finishing you one last time.
You fight how I remember. I know what you'll do before you do it. Likewise. Let's hope our advantage proves decisive. Fight! Missed fighting by Katana's side. Musa Let's rip the flesh from their bones. Are Tanya's of all timelines this evil? Mine is no better. You should meet mine. She's a vast improvement. I'd like that. Should we survive this battle? Fight! <laughs> Shang Tsung can do. It has begun. Liu Kang! Uh, we must stop them. If the hourglass is emptied, this timeline will be destroyed. Quickly, my friend. This battle ends with your timeline obliterated. Your final moments will be torture and pain. I do not fear your bravado. I have bested twins far more evil than you. Fight! <laughs> Let's <laughs> go. 
Shang Tsung has made us resilient. I won't go down Back to your timeline, brothers. We have little time. The hourglass is failing. Then let us end this now. Be good girls and kill them, won't you? As you command, Shang Tsung. Katana and I will fight them. You save the hourglass. Yes, Liu Kang. <laughs> Fool, you cannot save it. I don't know which of them is worse. Both are cracked reflections of me. They are abominations. Neither will survive this fight. Fight! Once Shang Tsung is finished, you will be too. Thank you, everyone, for your aid. This battle was won together. Shang Tsung is gone, but he's not defeated. He will be back to renew his campaign. 
Not only against this timeline, but against all timelines. Our choice is clear. We must take the fight to him. Destroy any power he has to make war against us. Agreed. Cheng Sung is likely already gathering allies as I gathered you. We must best his efforts. Assemble an overwhelming army from across all timelines. to run, Shang Tsung. Nowhere to hide. We have banded together to rid all timelines of your evil. The threat you pose to them ends today. Such certainty, Liu Kang, that this battle will end in your favor. It can end no other way, because across all timelines, the arc of history bends toward justice. Does it? In this timeline, it bends toward me. Behold, Liu Kang, the hell I unleash upon you.
save you now. Fight. to be dismembered. Thank you, Kitana. You're welcome. Now hurry. There's no time to waste. I can't wait to drench myself with your blood. Fight. sense of self-preservation. Yeah. 
Assist me, Quan Chi. Scorpion, you are almost there. I will make you burn. Further, Scorpion. Follow me. Your defenses have failed, Shang Tsung. This is over. I do not think so. Realize, Sorcerer, that you've brought this on yourself. Avarice and Ego have again proved your undoing. We have no choice but to eradicate you. It is you who will be eradicated. You and your followers. And once you are dead, all timelines will be mine. Your position is precarious. To survive, you must submit. Yes. The question you must ask is, if Liu Kang couldn't finish us, 
How possibly could you? Fight. And they called me the Chosen One. I am honored, Liu Kang. Shall we finish this? You have done more than enough. Please permit me to end this. May that be the last we see of you. What's happening? Timeline. Pao Sheng soon to hold it together. It's falling apart. You must return to your timeline before this one collapses. Thank you for your aid, Scorpion. May we one day meet again. I'm telling you, the locations we found here are money. I mean, look at this. Don't the rainbow colors on these mountains just scream outworld? I cannot believe you'll be telling our story about how we defeated Shang Tsung. Well, the studio thinks it's fiction, not fact. <laughs> but I don't care as long as it's covering the budget. <laughs> I assume you'll be the star. Nope, I'm behind the camera, writing and directing. Time to let someone younger and prettier take the lead. You know, I've written in parts for all of you, if you want them. Us? On screen? I mean, they're cameos. But like they say, there are no small parts. Thank you, Johnny. But we must decline. But Raiden! The new initiates arrive tomorrow. We must return to the Wuxi to begin their instruction. Of course, you are right. What about you, Takahashi? I need a blind swordsman. And no actor can do what you do. <laughs> I would love to. But my work to revive the Tyra is starting to pay off. I can't let up now. Well, I know better than to ask you. Your plate is always full. Indeed, Johnny Cage. Which is why I must now depart. Off to Outworld? To advise the Empress? Between her father and her sister, Melina is receiving plenty of good advice. And with the sorcerers and the general imprisoned, there are few threats to her rule. Is something wrong then? I am simply shoring up our defenses. As you know, Bi Han and his Lin Kuei have abandoned their roles as Earthrealm's guardians. His brother, Kuai Liang, has agreed to build a new clan, the Shirai Ryu, to take its place. I must go aid his efforts. Is there anything we can do? Not yet, but I will call upon all of you when the time comes. Madame Bo, once again you have served an excellent meal. That's kind of you to say. Enjoy the rest of your evening. And thank you, all of you. You have served well as Earthrealm's champions. No, Liu Kang, thank you. Joining up with you really has changed the arcs of our lives. I am glad. All right, gentlemen. If you're finished, there's only one thing left to do. Which one of you gets the bad news? Whew, not me. 
I'm still three mil in the hole on Sento. How uh, thick's your wallet, Takahashi? Thick enough, but seems to me our hosts are on the hook. They did invite you us. You think we have money? The Shaolin live modestly. Don't worry, Father. I've got this covered. Besides, my business manager tells me I can write this whole thing off. The realms are in safe hands. Now he struggles. Everyone who fought today did so fiercely. <laughs> Had I not been here for it, I would have thought it impossible. Warriors from across timelines clashing in combat. <laughs> the blood, the death. The chaos. Yes, Lord Havoc. It's unfortunate it all ended so fast. The next time, it won't.